Michigan as well as 96 here, another bit of review. This time, the Avengers movie series Marvel's Hawkeye. So, here you go. So, as you can see, the box, you get a nice picture of the figure, the whole team. Uh, and so, you can see it's purple, so that's pretty easy to spot it on the shelf. Uh, the, the rest of the storm is the Scroll Soldier, Black Widow, and uh, Thor. Um, haven't found Black Widow yet. Uh, did get the Scroll Soldier, though. So, yes, so very cool. Um, been waiting for this one forever. This is going to be a must-have for just about everybody who collects the Avengers. So, pretty much, I could tell you that the figure's awful, and that wouldn't change pretty much any of your minds because either you want to build the team of the Avengers or you don't. It really just doesn't matter how good the figures are at this point. You're going to buy it no matter what I say. So that's pretty much what I feel, but I'm still going to review it anyway. So anyway, let's go over the uh, gimmicky accessory. Um, is his bow here with like a little cannon on the side. The bow is the exact same thing, it's just glued onto this. And um, nothing too special. The bullets, they're all different. I don't know why they're all different, but they are. All you do is um, put it in here. And you just, it, there's no button or anything, you just move this back. And it fires, and it fires fairly well too, so pretty okay. Um, nothing too special, but uh, pretty good. What I would have liked a lot more than this is for them just to do one of these gimmicky arrows and then just one regular one. That's all I really want, but instead they give you three different gimmicky ones. Don't know why, but uh, what are you going to do? So, uh, as I said, this, this guy does lack uh, arrows, just like the 6-inch one, and I'm not 100% sure, but I think that the uh, select one doesn't come with any arrows, too, so this guy, uh, in all of his forms, it really lacks um, arrows, so yeah. So let's just talk about the figure. So first of all, the bow. As you can see, the bow here, it fits really good in his hand. Um, just so if you're wondering, he does hold the bow in his right hand um, in the movie and everything. Here's how he holds it and everything. It's it's way big. That's the only thing I don't like about it. It's, it's too big, I think. I think that it might just be a little bit too big. Just to shrink it up just a little bit would probably make it perfect. There is no, like, string here, um, which I get. I, I'm not it really upset about that at all. A, a kind of string piece of plastic that looks like a string would have been kind of cool to do, but still it's fine. Um, as I said, he doesn't come with any uh, arrows. He does come with this thing's called like a quiver or something. I don't really know what this little backpack is that holds the things. It's sculpted really well. It's um, more flat than the circle that the 6-inch uh, one comes with, and I like it a lot more than the 6-inch one, just because it's got some more detail and it's not a peg in. It stays up really well, so I really like this. Um, as far as just the sculpt on the body and everything, it looks pretty good. Uh, I really like all the sculpting over here. Very nice, and the lazy gets some buckles and everything. Looks great. Um, the, he's got a shield symbol here, which the 6-inch Walmart Exclusive one did have, but the Walmart Exclusive one was missing the symbol here. This one has it, so very nice. He is wearing glasses, and the face sculpt is great. Really uh, resembles Jeremy Renner, uh, who is the um, actor, so that's pretty good. Um, I think that it might resemble him more because he's got glasses on, they don't have to sculpt the eyes, so that maybe gives it a more realistic look, because the eyes might look not too realistic. But overall, really good uh, sculpt. I really love it. The design is great. Um, as far as articulation, he's got a ball jointed neck, uh, but it's mostly just sort of a little bit up and down. Ball hinge shoulders, uh, hinge shovel elbows. Uh, ball hinge thighs with thigh swivel, hinge swivel knees, and that is it. No ankles, no waist, no wrists. Um, what are you going to do? Pretty standard articulation for Avengers, although the Jatari figure that's coming out in the next wave has some ankle articulation, yes, but um, whatever, we're not really talking about that right now, but just so you know, the articulation might get just a bit better in the next waves. So very cool looking. He looks good. I like the they sculpted the gauntlet kind of thing on his arm up really good. Um, as far as the paint apps, uh, the paint applications, definitely check out the face. Um, you're going to really want to check out uh, the glasses on his face um, first. Uh, I luckily had three of these to go through at a Walmart, so I was able to pick the best one. There was some where the glasses painted were just not painted straight and it looked really bad and everything. And then check out the hair next going onto his face. And then you're going to want to check the... Um, the body area. I've got a couple missed paints as, as far as the strap onto the red right here. Uh, a little bit on mine, there's some little paint splotches, um, but this was the only one that had a pretty much perfect face, so I definitely was willing to sacrifice the paint apps on the, the uh, body to get a good paint apps on the head sculpt, so 
So yeah, so definitely check that out. So um, the accessory, it's all right. There's really nothing special with it. We really wish that they just, uh, they could even keep the accessory. Just gave him an arrow or like a string on the bow or something like that. But overall, it's a really cool figure. Here he is compared to the other person in this wave, the um, scroll soldier. I will be giving you plenty of group shots at the end with all the Avengers in him. Uh, so so yeah, so stay tuned for all those pictures. So just really quick, just fast examples of some of the Avengers. He's in pretty much perfect scale, so I won't go any more than that. Um, if you want to see the group pictures of the Avengers at the end, just stay tuned. So yeah, very cool figure. Very happy to have it. Uh, even if I said it was crap, you guys would still all buy it because everyone wants to build an Avengers team. And the three and three quarter inch toy size is the only size, other than Mini Mates, where you can have the entire team, and that's with Black Widow. So you're definitely gonna buy this no matter what. But uh, there you go. That's that's my thoughts on the figure. So there you go.